Alright, hey there Twitch, hey there YouTube, Phantasma Knight, hoping to make some more progress in this game, Plague Tale, Innocence. There's not a Plague Tale out, I haven't checked, but I'm assuming it's a sequel. Right, brainwashing, that's a thing. Shouldn't have been so hard on the kid, you even broke out of it. to find mommy we'll get her out of there hugo right that's enough hanging around hey wait i find her sad she'll be all right but can't we help her that's why we're here to help her get revenge and to keep her alive we got the kid and the rats we're invincible Fordrick, he's five years old yeah plus i'm not sure if his control rats is invincible um I bet I see a plenty of fear from rats, it's just not really small groups. Clothes are fancy. I, I guess that's one good thing about being brainwashed by an evil cult, they usually give you cool threads. Either that or they have you or they end up making you look like really edgy. Oh, shit. What's the matter? Melly, calm down. Those fucking rats blocked the safest entrance. They didn't mean to do it, Melly. They we don't have a choice. We have to try the great door. But watch out. Oh, Melly, wait. Is she angry with me? <laughs> no. She's just angry full stop. Agreed. Give her a little time, Hugo. Let's see. Okay, that is the yo crystal. It's been a little bit and I are already forgot. Yeah, we can make make one, why not? I have to make some more of this stuff, but um, yeah, let's check the inventory. Used to do that an awful lot. No harm checking it once in a while. Right, that's not too useful. Got to get this first. More alcohol, more leather, more cord as well. And we're gonna need some fabric for this, so let's save up. For now, let's get some yellow crystals and keep moving. Is there loot around? No, yeah, I think I got. Well, I don't know. Maybe this place is bigger. But I find it a little funny if the kid was like, "How, uh, how are we gonna find mummy and all this?" Or no, no, he was talking about how big this place was, something like that. I mean, the, the idea is still to see him. This kid just waltzed right into a keep, let them take him, broke out on his own, and yeah, found his mom in the dungeon. Almost got her out, too. Hey, do you think it's already started? I hope so. It looks like more and more of them around here. Three. It's risky. Alice knows what he's doing. You got plenty of people. He's in the back door. That's what he says. Chances are it's locked. They're going. It's in the shithole. We don't even know what's really going on in that damn thing. Time to make our move. Lucas, follow me. Millie. Have faith. In the meantime, we have a job to do. How oh, Lucas was just I went right after her. Be no careful. hesitation. Oh shit! They'll be seen. Distraction time. Hey! Stop! I'm going to help him. Stay here. Roger could take that guy down. Oh, well. She knows that you and take out the other one with a rock. Come on, we have to take advantage. Dang. Take care of him. You're finished. Ooh. Yeah, you could have taken out the other guy. Could have taken this guy out with a couple of rocks. I got a little carried away. Although I guess um, plot-wise, I might not have all this Devorantes just lying around. Speaking of which, I never looked up what Devorantes means. Maybe it doesn't actually mean anything, but I'm sure it's based on the Latin word. I guess we're not going that way. Excuse me. Of course, I'm sure chat didn't hear that verb, but um, yeah. It's changed a lot since last time. The bells, the cathedral, Amicia. That's where Vitalis is. Which means mother is too. That bastard's gonna get a surprise. First, we have to find the others. No, I realize I haven't burped in like the last few streams. At least I don't think I have. 
Does Vitalis have last name? I think he did, but I can't seem to remember. Uh, shoot, which way is the right way? Because as usual, you want to go the wrong way to get more loot. And my head itches. I mean, I get scratched definitely, I just don't want to move the mic too much. Don't like the sound it makes. Um, anyone else here or what? You don't need to tell me twice. Yep. Good job. I would have liked to have been on the end of that. Huh. Okay, got some materials. Don't have enough here, do we? Right, um, so you need two more leather. And some more cords, surprisingly. Can I make anything? Right, I'm all full up and... Saving for another ammunition upgrade. More crystals. That shaking. It's the rats. They're here, beneath us. Well, so I mean, they're the ones who destroyed everything. Look at the ground. Yeah, we we seen the yellow crystals. Oh, man, I I. They didn't make it look this easy in the rest of the game. Just stick a, a stick in the hole. Just stick a burn. Shove a burning stick in the in the ground, and that stops them. I mean, do we do we want to mess with rats? Um, I kind of don't want to. Holy crap! That's a lot of rats. Let's uh, knock off some heads instead. Heck yeah. You don't need no rats. Honestly, there's something that makes me a little nervous about using the rats. I mean, they might be sort of allied with the kid, but um kinda of feel like they're still the enemy. Honestly the kid should be able to overwhelm the Grand Inquisitor's powers, whatever they may be. Unless of course there's like some like double chosen one thing, you know, like he's the uh, he's the natural carrier, but I'm the true chosen one. I wouldn't no. touch that if I were you. Why? Cat of nine tails whip themselves with it. It's probably got bits of flesh in it. Ugh. Oh. Just two of them. Or three, rather. Yep, I can count those three. Lacerating their own flesh. Ironically, the Flagellants help <laughs> spread the flag from village to village. Ah. Episanguas all full of the stuff now. Consuming rocks. Oh, but it only takes one rock to make two of these things. So that's some value in the long run. And actually, I got rocks back, so it doesn't even matter. Oh. Got full rocks again. Whoa, almost missed that. Fabric. Yes, upgrade materials. Loot. <laughs> Loot is kind of a bad word. Because you're like, you, you know stealing from the dead or from houses that might not actually be abandoned but might have people returning to them later and sometimes they're really just you know spoils from killing people the captain was always his protege Vitalis has changed since the carrier arrived perhaps he's gone and found himself a new protege
Huh? What's that? That is nothing. Tell them you put up a good fight. Did he actually spot me? I was hoping he only saw the body. Trick. They can't see you, but they can definitely see me. Heavy armor? Goodbye. <laughs> Dude is tough. And he was forging blades too, but I haven't seen him use a weapon. Just knock over these soldiers. Seriously, if he had a, a decent blade, or, well, I guess he probably had a decent blade. He was probably trying to make, like, some legendary sword. If he actually had a blade he was satisfied with, he could probably just ram it through the, their chest from the front. stuff flowing around, I kind of don't want to free the rats. So scary enough. You know, I still don't know how I feel about Imperium. Like, I feel like it's a, it's a different and slightly better use of Odorous, but it's similar enough that it almost feels like a derivative of the same power. Anyway, we got everything, so it doesn't look like we'll have anything to do with heavy armor other than rats. And Roderick, of course. Praise Roderick. Right, let's go back to using regular rock, shall we? And I'm filled with a full of uh, all types of ammo other than hmm, other than regular rocks. Well, I mean I could like lure him over and then And then get Roger to kill him. Because if possible, I don't want to use the rats. I'll call. Hmm. Maybe I should have done something with the rock. Don't know what, though. All these rat holes. They clearly want me to extinguish them, but I mean, they they gave me Roderick too. Like, if they actually want me to extinguish all these, would they really be giving me Roderick? Look at all these materials. I don't even have the pockets to carry anymore. Man, I forgot what that my previous inventory amounts were, but 22 doesn't seem like all that much anymore. Oh, it's definitely a decent amount. Um, yeah, I still don't know if this is good enough for a final ability. Although, it looks like you can control a lot of rats like one, so maybe that is good. Oh, hey, rats. Yeah, I guess it does take a while to get 22 of each item, especially you consume almost all of it in one go to craft stuff. Only one cord? Okay, wow, it looks like we'll be lacking in cords for quite a while. I was hitting all the wrong buttons. Oh yeah! Oh, wow, this is this might be then the game. Is this the last, the final stretch? Kind of wish my buddy was here so I could ask him. Let me readjust my headset again. Yeah, I got this final item. Might have missed this. Don't think I missed this because I just got this. Okay, so we can use the rats. What other solutions do we have? Uh, well, we could go up here. I mean, I, I could think of ways to deal with them. Huh, it's a tool. Come on, can we use the bow? It kind of... If this was any other game, I'd... Maybe there is loot in there. Oh, maybe that's just a distraction? Don't want to break that. Okay, I want to lure this guy over and then use Roderick to kill him. 
Um, I saw loot glint thing. Oh, it was just that item that I left back there. Okay. Dead body, perhaps. Oh shoot, 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 shoot. So you were hiding, huh? How did you know I was here? You're obviously dumb. I'm gonna find you. Then I'm gonna kill you. Nah, Roderick kills you first. And you still try to kill me after Roger kills you? Um, well, I guess we'll be playing Phasmophobia, Middle Ages version. Deal with him? Really? No pots? I do want to kill these guys, but I don't know about freeing the rats. Whoa, game just froze on me. What just happened? Um, game? Are you okay there, game? Um. Shoot. Well, I guess we're, we're restarting. Uh, Alt F4 is not working. Granted, I haven't used Alt F4 on this new, um, new keyboard. Let's see. Control Alt. Delete. Oh. Okay, it's not responding. Yep. Okay, let's start up again. Hey, so backpack. Uh, uh, it's good to see you, man. Um, am I close to, uh, close to the end of the game now? Do you think I can finish in the next like two hours? Uh, wrong thing. Gotta open it back up here. Yeah, so I was trying to uh, kill everyone there without using the rats, um, but I made exception for that guy because Roderick apparently won't kill him. Also because those rats were in a cage, it wasn't like I was laying them out of the ground. I doubt this kind of game cares enough. Yep, I, I did the Hugo segment. Upload to YouTube and uh, <laughs> titled that sometimes this game makes you feel very small. So yeah, now um, Amicia has like this little fur thing on her shoulders, Hugo has fancier clothes, everyone else is still dressed exactly the same. Except for Arthur. Poor Arthur got a new uh, sword wound. Doesn't look great on him, he should get rid of it. Okay, let's do this again.
Do you can hear any noises? I'm eating corn while I'm waiting for these guys to uh, move along. I should have just hit that guy, Devorantus. Oopsie daisies. Come on, Roderick. Surely you do something about this guy. No? Alright, well, I guess I'll do something about it myself. Uh, what? Alright, game. Be that way. Freaking be that way. Uh, the auto aim could be a little frustrating sometimes. Oh, crap. I miss ya! Okay, uh, you know what? I definitely need to kill this guy with rats now. Uh, what even happened there? Should be able to get the guy with Devorante, it's easy. Hasn't Vitalis sent anyone out to search for him? That's weird. The captain was always his protege. This has changed since the carrier arrived. Perhaps he's gone and found himself a new protege. <laughs> Why'd you do that? Someone's gonna pay for this. Someone? I hope it's not me. I don't have a lot of money on me. Time to die, cowards. Come on. Come on. Oh, this auto aim is actually kind of frustrating. I should turn off. I don't know why. Why would Deverantis, of all things, focus on that lamp? Uh, let's see, what was it? Game, probably. I mean, my aim's not great, but uh, this is embarrassing. I almost got there already. Oh, come on. There we go. Finally. Good grief. Die faster, will you? Okay, okay, so there's some materials around here to get, and... What are you doing there? Can you get him, Roderick? Really Save me some ammo. Actually, am I actually saving materials? Yeah, just use this saltpeter and, uh... Alcohol, which uh, I should find decent amounts of. Wow! We're drinking. Stick close to us. Are you sure? Yes. They're listening to me. Wow. Definitely looks like there's some. Oh, look who's here! Oh, come on. Can I even knock that torch off his hand? Doesn't look like I can. 
And maybe I can extinguish it. Come on, Vermin. Get him. Oh, they found a corpse. Uh oh, god dang it. God dang it. Come on, restream chat. You know what? I'll, I think I'll bring down some extra plague just to deal with this guy. Why not? First, I'm gonna find you. Then I'm gonna kill you. Yes, I was hiding. What about it? Are you serious? Well, that's a convenient tool you got there, isn't it? Have I mentioned you're gonna die, buddy? Go ahead and chew on some other corpses. They're, they're not gonna hurt us? Really? Really? I mean, alright. God, that could have gotten a little better. <laughs> alright, for that stuff, for that stuff, um, some crystals. Probably some fabric around here I totally missed. Some salt Peter. Sal Peter. There was fabric around here, wasn't there? No, there's fabric. Question is, is there more? I unleashed a plague on the world because I was bitter. <laughs> bitter. No, I was just spiteful. I don't know if it's dangerous for me. It feels dangerous for me. Am I just making use of the rats just like that? You know, if the passing the threshold lets him control the rats, what was everyone so afraid of? Why did it look like he was gonna die? What's this about embracing it completely? Of course you didn't. You're not an alchemist. I get to say yes? I want to search for loot first. I always gotta go for the loot. And backpack, I don't know you're still there, but <laughs> I got so many games to play these days. And I should be playing more off stream as well. And heck, I should be playing more games on stream. Alright. But there's only seven days in a week. I decided to take one day off. I did absolutely nothing last night. Well, okay, I guess I play some Phasmophobia with pubs. Yeah, there, I, there were some demos I wanted to check out and also some games on sale. But I keep buying stuff and I don't have the opportunity to uh, play them. Especially if I wait for stream. You know, before I'd either buy a game and it would sit in my backlog forever and a half, or I would play them right away. I'd probably get tired of them after like playing like five hours of non-stop and then just, you know, it doesn't hold my attention or whatever. Kind of unfortunate. Okay. 
Can I? I wonder. Can I tell? Can Roderick die? That's an important question. Probably. Um, he'll probably get spotted, and then he'll be in trouble. And he only—at least—he only gets spotted when he's attacking people. Seems like they don't care if he's just sneaking about. God dang! I missed my chance. It only appeared for half a second there. God dang it. What was that? That looks like a person, right? Hey, there's somebody here. Oh god. No! Nope. I miss ya. Uh... Look out. Can I make these guys hurt a little more? Screw you! Oh, come on. Oh, this is pathetic. This part is so easy, and yet I'm so I somehow keep getting killed. Kill you, cause I can. I'm gonna kill you. And we got enough rats for this. Oh hey, allies have appeared. Maybe I shouldn't be using the rats. See, I, I try to be all honorable, like, and then I screw it up completely. Amicia can't hear you. She's busy looting. Nope. I don't know what you have to say, but I don't want to hear any of it. Oh hey, more materials. Need one more leather, I think. Nope, I can't hear you. Can I walk in here safely? Dang. Oh, the one saw Peter. I haven't been using pots for ages. I wish you would make like a straight Molotov cocktail out of uh, the pots. That'd be cool. Okay, okay. I guess I'm done looting. More rocks? Shit, might as well. Rocks? Amicia, you're alive! Listen, Vitalis is at the cathedral. That's all very well, but the whole battalion is coming our way. You need to get out of here. L take the stairs. The house is an exit on the other side. Um, the one that's on fire. We can't go back. Go! We'll meet you on the other side. Be careful. Come on, the house. Is it gonna open? I don't think Extinguish will open the door for me. Oh. Ah, locked. Roderick. You swine. You see? Some guards are coming. Roderick, take cover. We'll handle them, Hugo. Have fun. That was nothing. Well, I just my aim at last moment, that's great. Oh, that guy's gonna be a pain in the butt.
Whoops. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, so I don't have to be afraid of the rats. I thought they were coming to kill me. There's too much freaking fire. Especially on this SOB. Why? Why aren't they answering? Oh, that's because they're occupied, that's why. Okay, I guess I need to waste so much more extinguish. Jeez, I keep <laughs> selecting the wrong thing. Don't make them angry. Oh, wow, I missed fabric. And leather. I think I got enough. Jeez. Low on rocks now. Maybe I'd save those bags for later. But I didn't, so now it's too late. Wait, that's not. Okay, that's not a bag. Uh, let's uh, take a moment to um, give myself some more. Nope, need more cords. This house is on fire. <laughs> nah, we'll be fine. I promise. Roderick, are you with us? To hell and back. Ah, let's hope we make it back. Do I have a time limit here? It kind of feels like it. Oh, hey, cord. Just one more. More fabric. Huzzah. More leather. Can you do it? Yeah. Of course I can, he's awesome. Hey, it's a chest. An empty chest. Good thing the whole house didn't collapse on him when he barged through it. Calm down. Yeah, but after how much time? Hugo, you beat the captain of the Inquisition. <coughs> You're a tough guy. Tougher than I am. Really? I never lie. <coughs> Think you can do this? All right. <laughs> this must be the exit. Well, that I, you know, I was gonna say that Roderick is a slower, louder lockpick, but uh, I don't think Melly's lockpick could have dealt with that. Yeah, so I already forgot what I what new games I got recently. Um, well. I mean, I got a couple games. I think I played at least one of them on stream. Then I think I might have bought another one. I'm thinking about buying like two more. And then I got some more demos to play. So, long story short, there's too much. That one's for you. You're finished. Snap. Well done. I might have got a little carried away. You know, I, I was like trying to remember is like, hmm, did he just choke people out? Maybe I'm exaggerating when I say he's killing people, but that was definitely an x nap Amicia, what do we do now? Hang on, I'm thinking. We save them, of course. Hi there. I'm in. Bye there. Very dead, so I guess you can't say hi. I keep seeing the glint of loot, and it like glints white, as if I could pick it up. And I run up, and it's red. Loot sensitivity needs to be turned down. Thank you. Thank you. Lord bless you. Yes, thank you. And good luck. Wait. Wait. Ah, ah too dangerous. The archers shoot on sight. Are we stuck here? Uh, am I really out of range of those bastards? 
Ah, man, I don't want to, to, to see her die again, but... What? Ah, uh, it's because of these fences. Like person, right? Guess we gotta go around. Or use this as cover. Either or. It was nothing. We don't have enough cords, do we? Oh, I guess we do. Okay. Not bad. Not bad at all. You know, maybe it's time to make some somnum. Not yet, not yet. <laughs> not quite yet. The cart, Roderick. If we push it to the port, Callis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Hey! Leave it, Amicia. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. I'll be fine. If you want to help, keep an eye out for guards. All right. All right, let's do this. Hi, Does it actually Don't worry give him enough cover? Dang, okay. Yeah, I could use more alcohol, could use... You know, I'm gonna make some anyway. Soldiers! Soldiers ahead! Amicia! They're all yours! What? 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 What just... But, 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 line of sight. That was all dramatic and then it failed horribly. It's, I forgot, was there any loot here? I mean, there's a workbench. There's all, usually loot on the workbench. Ooh, whoa, I didn't notice this. Oh, what was I supposed to be looking at? Oh. You, you shouldn't. Why? This place. I know it all too well. What is it, Roderick? Uh, there was a cord around here I missed. Gotta find it. Okay, there we go. Okay, now we have room to pick up all the alcohol. This should make things a little easier. Um, I don't know. What is he worried about? Well, guess I might as well find out, eh? Grab this. Well, you're not going to tell me what's behind here. I'm just going to go through. I already spent a valuable rock. This alleyway. Uh, no. I knew it. This where his dad died, what's isn't it? On? Where are you going? Let's go. To his dad's corpse. Is it also freaking enshrined before the rats take it? It can't be. Rotrick. There's nothing left. Did they burn your house down? It was my father's forge, where I grew up. It's where... I know how you feel, but you're still alive, and your roots, they can never take that away from you. You're right. It looks I like I can steal like that. Come on. Steal smoldering, after all this time. See, mommy's lovely. We'll go together, and we'll find another castle. Fine by me. I'm in. Yes, your mom is quite pretty, but uh, why exactly are you bragging that to your male friend? Are you perhaps trying to get his attention? Okay, I can't light that even though it looks like I can. It's it's a dead end, there's nothing here. It's weird, uh, you expect like at least a collectible or something. Hmm, maybe I earned a better ending? I doubt it. Didn't save everyone I could, even. Even though I think the only one I truly failed was that one guard asshole. 
Man, I'm so spiteful. Like, I, that wasn't a sw spare, swear word, but still, I didn't want to be that rude on stream. It's supposed to be an honorable night and all that. I'm supposed to lead by example. Better than these guys, at least. These jerks. Do I. Yeah, let's do it. The cart! Roderick! If we push it to the port, Kallis, it will give us cover. Hugo will be protected behind it. Right, they spent so long talking, and hey, then I die and then lose it. What are you doing? Stay back with your brother. I'm pushing. Roderick, let me help. He's totally Please going stop. to get shot. To the, the question is, is he going to die? Alright. Alright, let's do this. Don't worry about me, kid. Look, if I'm in the cart shadow, I should be fine, right? Wasn't I in the cart shadow when I got hit? Or no, I guess I was too far out to the side like this. Whoa, shoot. HP do you have? Yeah, what he said. Oh, I lost some rocks. Oh man, you took two arrows. We're here. Come on, come on, quick! Oh my God, Roderick! I'm a bit better. I'm right. Behind you. All right. We have an alchemist here. <sighs> Healing potions, all that. I mean, if, go, go. you know, if I hadn't thought this was an RPG party before, it definitely is now. Your turn. Oh, he's gonna die here. He's totally gonna die here. Or at least he's gonna be left behind, at the very least. Bleeding too much. Even then, he's got a much higher constitution score than everyone else. All that HP. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Save! Save! Hugo, come on. We have to go. That's always Lucas's calm attack. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. This can't be happening. Melly, please. No. Those bastards have to pay. I'll make them pay. Our priority is to stay alive and stay together. That's why Roderick and Arthur sacrificed themselves. Just leave me alone. She's right, Melly. Actually, I'm inclined to think that Arthur just kind of screwed up. Jake. But it's fine because he actually saw it. A rain. I can't take any more of these bloody rats. Bastards! No, Arthur witnessed it a good moment. I would have turned to look too, as dumb as it would be. Although me, I might be eventual enough. I would. Really? How? Like this? How do you? Wow, it's Hugo. Tell me you're going to help us kill those bastards. Oi. Melly. We've got no chance without your brother and his son. You get that, right? I will help you. And you're going to help us save mummy. You've got yourself a deal. 
kid's really grown up. I mean, he's never acted like he was five. I will say that to the end of this game. It's nothing, don't worry about it. No more Roderick. No more instant killing these guards. Come on, take off fast. Jeez, with the rock, but alright. I'll take it. Get ready. Listen to me, try not to swear in a game where all the NPCs are swearing. Hmm, I should double check to see what I need for that upgrade. Okay, just one alcohol for that one. And another alcohol there. Let's use up some more of these materials, shall we? Oh hey, materials. And a workbench. More materials. More rocks, I appreciate that. More tools I don't need. Oh, some of these rats are having a good time. Right, need a lot more cords. Well, maybe we won't be able to upgrade further. I probably miss cords. At like the very least, I know I didn't use them up on Somnium. And did I use them? Okay, Luminous and Somnium do not need it. I'm gonna need more alcohol for it, though. Okay, let's keep going. Actually, was that the shine of loot back there, or just metal glinting? Uh, I was light glinting out the wheel. Okay. Alright, alright. Oh, you're just gonna go straight to the front? Gord! So much sulfur. Archers. Notice that way too late. Actually, I didn't notice that at all. I was like, wait, what hit me? And I'm like, oh, it's the a bell. Fuck. It's a bloody mess. Get ready. occurred to me that using extinguishers would probably be easier than manually aiming with a rock. Also, um, if I'm worried about losing rocks, well, it's one rock to two extinguishers. I have all these materials back here. All right, let's go on the second looting run of the, this area. Huh? I guess they'll let me keep everything else here. I don't need rocks to commit murder. Okay, maybe I do. Use this on him. You know what? That's fine. Okay, I can't finish him off. That guy got way too close. 
I can make more Sondam, right? Uh, I'll run out of other materials. I don't, I don't need this much fabric left, do I? Let me check one last time. Yeah, only six fabric. Sheesh. It's gonna use up all my alcohol, but... And I feel like I should actually save alcohol so I could max up on the other stuff too. Yeah, this went poorly. Do I need alcohol? Yes, but not very much. Which is good because I'm going to be using alcohol for everything. Ooh! Oh no, that's just rocks. And rocks are valuable. I'll take it. Can I walk through here? Oh hey. That's cool, huh? Okay, you know what? The, this power is cooler than I thought. Well, I mean, as an actual power, it's not that useful. But it's nice that it's got this passive ability. Like, I, I know that. The rat. In terms of like programming, <laughs> the rats going away from you is completely separate from your ability to direct them with um with Imperium or yeah Imperium. But still, I think it's a nice touch. Are you serious? Is that your manual for this shit? Yeah, murder as many people as you can. We're gonna make sure there won't be a second volume. Well. Uh, is this the way to go? Jeez, this nest is crazy. Why are they doing this of their own volition? Or are they collectively be controlled by the the Magla or whatever it is? Or are they listening to Vitalis? Expecting more loot in there, but I guess I did get some unique stuff, so that's something. Whoa. This is actually kind of cool. Although, you know, I still don't understand like the whole threshold thing. It's like, oh no, he's nearing the first threshold. We gotta uh, slow down before he dies. Kit looks fine now. And he's more powerful than ever. Oh, oh, oh no, Thomas. that's just a rock. Amisa, he's going to do something very bad. I Whoa. Think bad. Like what? Coming the cathedral and gun? Whatever he's up to, we're here to kill him, right? Yeah, hopefully he's stop him. Dead. Dead. Let's go, Hugo. Mummy's in there. It's probably gonna conjure like freaking demons or something. Oh. Lucas, Melly, stay where you are. Oh my God, you guys. Why do I have to hide myself? Uh, surely you guys don't think you're brave. Like, are you guys actually accomplishing something here? Resources and loot. Why does she still wear a mask? Something. Why do none of them wear a mask? Melly. Help me. No one else must get in. To understand, Beatrice. Mommy! My child. Hugo! Amicia! Mother! Did Vitalis do this? He sacrificed them. 
He's past the threshold. Go get out of here. Oh, for pity's sake. Hmm. Hugo, are you ready? Yes. The rats are here. Then let's go. Stay close to me. We're coming to. Is Vitalis's rat power weaker than Hugo's? And if not, can we even the odds with Odorous? Let her go, Vitalis! This is your last chance! Hugo, your power! You have to be careful! I'm fine, don't worry! Yes, he's a very gifted student. Too bad his forgotten food taught him everything he knows. Shut up! Uh, I hope Melee has something more than just rage. I hope Lucas has some alchemical preparation ready for this. Oh, what exactly? I still have things to teach the carrier and his friends. <laughs> You're so touching. Thank you. Thank you for your candor. Do you hear them? The angel. The angel of the new world. Oh, the white rats, of course. Looks almost. This looks almost adorable. What the? He's getting them to regroup. They're not stopping. The light isn't stopping them. I can do it. Really? Go on, you go. It's our only chance. Jeez. Ah, god damn it. Right, swearing again. I need to find something better than restream chat. Watch the abyss. With this the end of what remains of your lineage. Leave them alone. They're children. Bro, they are merely relics of the old world. Stop it! I need to extinguish some things. You have come to challenge me. Me, Vitalis Benevol, carrier of the Prima Macula, crowned by blood. Um, couldn't Hugo do that? Hey, you actually have some? Really? That's actually probably the biggest surprise here. Oh crap, I didn't mean to waste that. Oh well. Um... Why are you guys talking about innocent people? He clearly doesn't care. Everything about you is playing with you. Listen to him. Machira is in your blood. It can reach your heart. Those you are about to create is a world of chaos. Give us back. I mean, he's kind of already created chaos. Whoa, shoot. Come on. Awkward. Awkward. If uh, only well, I could send these things further, faster. He's getting them to regroup. They're not stopping. The light isn't stopping them. I can do it. Really? Go on, you go. It's our only chance. <laughs> Yes! 
show him the big man that you know. Watch me, Trace. Witness the end of what remains of your lineage. Leave them alone. The children. Wrong. They are merely relics of the old world. Stop it. You cut yourself, Vitali. You have abandoned your followers. Slaughtered innocent people. They don't care about innocence. But the new one to be born. That is why the rats devour it. You know nothing, but the Matria knows everything about you. It's playing with you. Listen to him. Matria is in your blood. He can read your heart. The world you are about to create is a world of chaos. Give us back our mother! Okay, this is where I died last time. Because I was being bad, not not because this game is hard or anything. What? What? I. Uh, I'm gonna have to restart from the beginning, huh? Okay, okay. Let's go. Let's do this again. He's getting them to regroup. They're not stopping. But I can do something. I can do it. Really? Go on, you go. It's our only chance. You have come to challenge me. Please. Unbelievable. I gotta admit, him being able to control these white rats is more than I expected. I know he designed them, but couldn't figure out what they were used for. Because, I mean, Hugo couldn't control them. And his power is, has the same basis. Uh, I kinda want to use Odorous or something. Whoops. Well, there goes uh, all the alcohol. That is why the rats devour it. You know nothing, but the Machia knows everything about you. It's playing with you. Listen to him. Machia is in your blood. You can reach your heart. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wow, it knocked them away and I still died. Why? I feel like this game could be a little more smooth. Um, like I, I know I could definitely, I could stand do better. I, I shouldn't be dying so often here. But I don't know. I feel like the game could run just a little smoother somehow. I know it's mostly my fault. The rats come from so far away, but it's so slow. I don't feel like prepping, especially because I'm going to have to knock the fire out of them anyway. Oh, come on! I, I can't believe I'm getting stuck here. I know I'm not good at games chat, but... <laughs> oh, this is actually a little bit painful. Okay, don't get too close to the white rats. Whoa, I thought I was gonna fail there. Okay. Thought the rats were getting dizzy. Oh my god, that was close. I would have been upset. Oh, 
Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, we're pushing the white rats back, that's good. I really would want to use just Odorous right about now, instead of all this mess. Okay, okay, okay. I'm starting to understand this a wee bit better. Oh, oh, please don't let me die here. Knowing bad guys, he has one last trick up his sleeve. Oh, come on. Ah, did it again. Alright. God. Dang it. Keep trying, trying to press control, but um, the restream chat's like right around here, that's why I keep clicking on by accident. Oh god, that almost got me killed. One less fire to deal with. Oh, but I didn't do it in time. Okay, here's my next chance. Oh boy. Holy crap, I think I got too close. Apparently a not, if I can't hit it from this range. Come on. It'd be cool if they let me use the Rat Tornado earlier. It would be so broken, but still. Mommy! Okay. No. I saw a checkpoint thing. See? Oh, we'll take care of it. Okay, and here I thought the bad guys were going to do some weird sacrifice thing. You feel it too, don't you? But it scares you. The true power. The gift of self. I am unity. I am the blood of blood that connects all people. Get back! Stay with you guys! Become one Move again! Um, what I do? All the angels will descend on the earth! Come! Yeah, but what do you want me to do? Soon, they will join us! I can't reach him! She can run away from the Come on! Now? My followers, you go. return to your mask. No, fire to rest. He has no more rest to protect him. No, no, it's impossible. You pay for this. Come to me. Come to me. What am I supposed to do with all these materials? Is there any point in having them? Oh shoot, 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 shoot. Too bad I can't get a double shot in here. This is your last affront. I sacrificed my flesh to become 
the crucible where everything unites. Yeah, sure. Cannot kill that which is simply mated. Okay, how obvious are your attacks? I have no idea. Oh, did I? I got in his way, didn't I? What? What? <laughs> really? Oh, please don't. Um, we're going to reduce in the beginning. No doubt. Oh no! You know, I wonder if Odorous works on this stuff. I mean, I haven't had use for it ever since I got Imperium. Okay, time to use Odorous, because why the heck not? I want to hit him with Devorantos, actually. Okay, I couldn't hit him with Devorantos. Where's some alcohol when I need it? Oh, it just... oh, crap. Did I get any alcohol? I don't know. Ah, uh, but they're on the way. Is that messed up? Or did I? Uh, I need one more cord, and I, of course, I used up all my alcohol again. I wonder if the speed changes. Oh boy. Oh boy. Well, the rats are kind of in the way now. Ah, oh, jeez, that was close. I'm running, I'm running. Oh, well, I screwed that up. Okay, this is this is getting frustrating. This is getting real frustrating. Oh 
Come on, come on, come on. You can do better than this. Me. Me, not him. I don't want him to do better. Okay, the sling actually is bad for this. Okay. Let's uh, throw a rock. Hi. You have an army of bloodthirsty rats. But you need rocks to finish the job. It's over. This, folks, is a shining counterexample of what you should not grow up into. Hmm. Uh, I would say that was a bit of an unsatisfying ending. Uh, maybe there's an epilogue scene. But I never liked it back when, with anime, um, anime series where the fight ends as soon as the climatic and uh, final battle ends. Like, as soon as the finishing blow is dealt to the boss, it ends right there, credits roll. You have to have a little bit more closure for everyone. You know, they go, go back home, they try to rebuild. They part ways after a tearful farewell, something like that. Or you know, at least explain what this, why this macula is name a, is known as an ancient evil when it seems to just you know listen to you. Like what happens? You get, go too far. Do you just become a rat swarm? Do you become like that inquisitor dude? I mean, that inquisitor dude obviously didn't have the power before, and he keeps talking about sacrificing his flesh. What does that mean exactly? Do he have to condition himself to be a carrier? Like, I, as far as I can tell, he was just getting high off of Rat Plague. Took one hit of it and got addicted. Couldn't live without it ever since. Came out with some BS excuse for his followers to listen. And honestly, for a guy who says he's gonna save them all from the Rat Plague, um... Seems to have killed an awful lot of people with those rats. I guess there's a possibility that he didn't kill them, and they were already dead, and he just decided to set up shop there. Okay, cool. Epilogue chapter, let's go. Let's go. Okay, let's patiently go. Do I have to click? I thought I clicked. Oh. Okay. Three days later. All right, let's go. Have we got everything? Yes, that's all Lucas asked for. Is mommy going to get better with this? She will be all right, Hugo. Mommy hmm. is tough, isn't she? Just like you. That's right. I can't wait for us to find a new castle. I... Are these Hugo's <laughs> We've got old the taste clothes? Of the king now. We'll see what we can do. We have to leave the region first. I can't tell, are these his old clothes? Is the red scarf thing new? Was it always there? Was that a piece of his last outfit? That'd be cool if it was a piece of his last outfit. So, were you able to go home? Yes. The nest is still there, but it's empty. No one's trying to kill these two anymore. I can't believe the rats are gone for good. Let's what? hope they are. Is that cauldron made of gold? Does brass look like that? Man, that's some shiny... That's, that's shiny. I thought the best they got was iron. Although, arm might be tougher than... Oh, 
Well, I don't know about brass, but tougher than copper, at least. Try your hand at shooting. Not me. My sister's really good. Right, Amicia? Um, sure. I'll right. probably fail this. Let's have a go. Good. Good. The rule is simple. You have six stones, six possible shots. Try and shoot as many targets as possible. Are you ready? Oh, is there a time limit? Ready. Go on, Amicia. the last two. There's one. Is that a target? No, that's one I already hit. Oh, there. Hey, you know how to do it. You want an apple. And all due respect. <laughs> yes, Amicia, what? The apple's for you, Hugo. You're my biggest supporter. Oh, thanks. I was hungry. <laughs> As always. Hey, today we're celebrating the third day without rats. There's a little fair down the street. Go take a look. A fair? A real fair? I've never seen a fair before. Hugo, Lucas is waiting for us. We should be getting back. But it's a fair. Come on. Hugo. But, <laughs> right. but let's bring Lucas long. to the fair. We can Yellow the jerk. Village, but there will still be empty houses. Probably because you guys murdered everyone. Us in peace. People will come back eventually. Um, people will come back? Jeez. That's optimistic. And here I was like, everyone died. You're going to deliver grain. It's been three days since we've seen a rat. We have to get back to work. Uh, it's true that we don't see anyone in the fields anymore. Precisely. The nobles, the lords. Do you think they'll get their hands dirty? Never. But they do have money. And if they want to eat, they'll have to pay us a lot more. Hey, but you're right. Ah. I'm telling you, everything will change. The rats were you a necessary guys, evil. You guys are way too optimistic. Yeah, so, you know, it's like they're talking about people coming back. I'm like, okay, lots of people got killed by the rats. Lots of people got killed by the Inquisition. Lots of people got killed by, you know, townsfolk on a crusade. Or a lynch. And those guys... If the nobles want to eat, they'll pay us a lot more. Um, you know, if they have any soldiers and knights left in their employ, I think they'd rather pay... I mean, it depends on how nice the nobles are. Decent ones, yeah, they would pay more. Not so decent ones, like, you know, a lot of the NPCs in this game, they would just, like, hire some thugs, you know, some people who... You know, the reason why mercenaries are depicted... I mean, are ill-perceived in real life compared to, like, the same video game and so on, or I heard it's because... It implies that a mercenary has no marketable skills other than killing things. You know, other than fighting. You're basically just a hired thug. So, the nobles, with all the money, could hire a bunch of the thugs for cheap, go in, rough these guys up, take their grain. Now, I mean, you would have to, like, basically, like, do some kind of, some form of slavery to get them to work after that, but... You know, I'm just saying, the nobles might not be nice enough to just say, Hey, we're gonna pay you like 100 times what we originally did. Hey, look. Oh. They might just take it. The young boy. Oh no. No, no, boy, you just can't come in. But why? Because you can. That's why. I wonder. You look just like one of the, the helmetless guards. I'm sorry, but you have a, a uh, I was gonna say a punchable face, but I was honestly gonna drive a rock in it if the game would let me. I wonder, are they still treating him poorly because he's one of the Daroons? Because they think he's the cause of all this? But you know, they're a lot more respectful than they were before. Well, I say they were before, but honestly, these this might not be the same people. Maybe they know what the kid's capable of. Wouldn't that be interesting? Hey, is there a problem? Look, the problem is a kid and his sister are wanted around here by important people. And we, well, we, we just don't want any trouble here, you understand? I can see very well. Hugo, we have to go. What the fair? Come on. Important people. Hmm. 
really not at the Pope. And that Archbishop seemed out really powerless. I honestly expected that guy to die, the Archbishop. Like, yes, you can't just off. The first one to arrive at the cart wins 20 apples. 20 apples? You'll never beat me. Right, Slug? What? You see. Oh, yeah? Then on three. I'm pretty sure this kid runs faster one, than she does. Two. Three. Hey. Look at how fast this kid runs. Holy crap. I'm right behind you. You can't beat me. <laughs> I don't think I want to beat him. I want the kid to have 20 apples. All right. All right. You won. Oh. I literally can't beat him. We made it, Lucas. Do you have everything? St. John's what? The Hawthorne? All of it. Let's go. Good. Amicia? Yes? Why are they looking at me like that? Melly looked at me the same way. Then she left. Because she doesn't like me anymore. Hugo, she... She had other things to do. That's not true, but it doesn't matter. I rather think she that to sleep much longer. She has to get her strength back. With the herbs you bought, she'll soon be back on her feet. All right. I like to think that Millie does like Hugo a lot better than these townsfolk do, at least. I'm sure she appreciates him killing or participating in killing Vitalis and that Nicholas. You're ugly. Really ugly. <laughs> what did you put on ugly. her head? Me. You look like a big fat fly. Ah, glasses. A fly. Your own sister. Oh, such a slur requires punishment. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I'd rather li like um, Roderick's rage, or how it was portrayed. And Arthur... We... We could've known that. We could've got taken longer to get to know him. I think this game's a decent length though, so... Maybe that that's what happened. Maybe they thought about doing that, but then they decided to cut Arthur's bit short to keep the rest of the story going strong. He probably has similar skills to Melee anyway. But I mean, both Melee and Arthur are those like, these with a heart of gold type of characters. They could've run, they didn't. Even back before they made friends with these two. Or three, you count Lucas. And Lucas did trick them. But they didn't try to get even with him or anything. Spend a while zoning out there, nibbling on core. Let's see, thoughts about this game. I liked it overall. Despite all my complaints, I liked it. Um, the story was moderately interesting. I wouldn't say it was like absolutely amazing. I mean, it was, um. I was, I was gonna say typical, but I can't like condense it down into a few enough tropes. Uh, let's see, you have the protagonist who loses their home and family at the beginning of the story. Older sibling trying to look after a younger sibling. 
it's usually like that. Stories that have siblings usually have a big enough age gap that one has to clearly take care of the other. Kid had some smart moments. He had some kid moments. Definitely superhuman. And as I promise, I'm gonna say it again. Hugo is not five years old. His physical ability, his intelligence when he wants to use it. Hmm, I'm <laughs> blanking out again. I was thinking about that whole RPG party thing. Hugo would be some kind of mage, I think. You know, summons a horde of minor monsters. Some games actually have a summoner class, but it works in various ways. I found out that a summoner in a tabletop RPG can be broken because, well, it's effectively giving someone a second character. And, you know, if if they're if both characters are at least halfway decent, then well, <laughs> it might not be twice as good as everyone else, but you're definitely more powerful than a single character and have more, a lot more versatility. Versatility? Yeah. Can English. Oh man, I, I missed all the, the voice actors. I wonder if there were people I knew there. Or people I knew of. I don't personally know any voice actors, I don't think. Yeah, okay, I like the Spartan cast. They were all nice enough people. Even if they're angriest, as they were acting the most put pissed off, they were all good people. The bad guys, eh. They weren't really characters you could sympathize with, even though the game tried to make it seem like... I don't know, like, was the game trying to make it, you sympathetic towards them? Or was it not? They kept acting like they had a reason for what they did. Like they were doing stuff for the greater good. But I don't know. They were power hungry. They were cruel, they were vicious. Sometimes it seemed like they delighted in hurting people. I'm not gonna deny that the main characters had those moments too. There were there were times when Emisia was really pissed off, but I mean, let's face it, she's been away from home for a long time. She saw her father and most of the um, the servants around the household. Basically, employees, like almost family to her if they've worked there a long time, just get slaughtered around her. It didn't seem like she had a whole lot of friends. So yeah, it was just her and her family and, and the local folks and they pretty much all got killed. So yeah, I can't blame her for being vicious. Let's see, do we have anything in the extras? Huh, we missed a lot of stuff. Illegal code. The heresies to be condemned. Corresponding penalties and procedures to be followed. For the sake of ethics, it favors the common good rather than that of individuals. Advocates cruel sentences in order to make examples of still a sense of terror among the people. Hmm, I can see that going both ways. These guys, though, it seemed like the terror was his own end. Is he really gonna end the plague? He's talking about like creating a new world. Yeah, I guess technically he's ending the plague if he ends the world. Um, I feel like I should have something more insightful rather than the game was good. Some characters were likable, some were not. Oh, uh, so recently I saw a clip of um, an infestation of mice in, in Australia, just running across the fields. They didn't look quite like this. Like all these. The bodies pressed together, they were like tiny little dots just like scattering across the fields. Very fascinating. But yeah, they, they didn't look like this. They almost remind me of a fly swarm, except a ground based one. Just a bunch of little white dots just like moving across the ground very fast. If you look closely, you can see the shape of rodents. But they definitely weren't this obvious. That distinct rat's tail. Those glowing eyes. Oh, that's why the screen was dark, because I was still on that menu. <laughs> that was a good length. 
27 chapters, huh? Or no, that's 17, not 27. 17 chapters. Yeah, that... Hey. There was a, um... At the castle, there was like that underground tomb. Or, you know, that... Uh, or like that the coffin, or sarc sarcophagus. And there were those symbols there in the... Probably not this exactly, but the symbol in the... The courtyard? Or maybe this is it, actually. Because he cleared it away, remember? But yeah, I felt like they left a little too much... Like, unexplained, um... Mostly just around this whole Prima Macula thing, like, what exactly is it? Where did it come from? What kind of effects it would have in the long term? Like, what was it trying to do? Infesting this world? How did Hugo get rid of it? Did he just say, go away now? You know, like, a bunch of details, like... As a story, it's... I mean, you look at it in simpler terms, they, they, they hit the point. They introduce the characters. They introduced some climb, uh, some conflict. Um, they had some climbing or rising action. I guess. Well, uh, okay, I'm not going to go through the whole hero's journey thing. But you know, they had conflict. They had a villain. They had good characters. They had ones uh, that were obvious villains. They had an A conclusion. If you leave out the nitty gritty details, all you gotta know is that this uh, that the issue's over for now. Their mom's. Their next goal seems to be getting their mom back up to shape. Yeah, the rats are gone, at least for a few days now. This is a decent enough story. I just feel like if you start poking at the details, too many things are falling apart. And honestly, like I keep complaining about some of the, the ways the characters act, but you'd have to take some liberties in the story. The best stories don't have to don't have to they'll force the reader or the viewer or the player to just hand wave all that stuff around. They'll come up with an explanation or frame it in a way that you don't care as much about the explanation or that you don't think as much about the explanation. And for a lot of players, I don't think they would have been less concerned. Just these kind of details always bother me a little bit. But yeah, as you know, if you think of it in terms of a movie, it's not the best movie ever. But it was nice. It did its job. It entertained. It was a spectacle to behold. Hey, good voice acting. Yeah, I don't have a lot of uh, profound things to say. It was a good game. Um, I'll definitely look into the sequel at some point, if it is indeed a sequel. Just the fact that it has the, the name A Plague Tale in it, it's enough uh, for me to be interested in. But uh, we're going to have, man, we have a lot of games to play. Um, let me uh, let me take a look at my Steam for a moment. Okay, well, I'm probably gonna try some demos in my own time. Um, there's Ghost Runner, Tormented Souls. Ghost Runner is I thought that was a VR game, but it looks like it's some kind of high-paced first-person game where your main weapon's a sword. I want to say. Um, well, I know one of my viewers suggested I play it, along with a bunch of other games, so I might look into getting this one. Um, it's on sale for now. Pretty cheap. I should try the demo. Tormented Souls reminds me of old-school Resident Evil, along with the fixed camera angles. I feel like they went out of the way to make those angles annoying, though, in this game. But I should try that. Uh, something that looks kind of anime, called Anno Mutationum. Anno is an A-N-N-O. And that second word, uh, it looks like mutation with an extra E-M at the end. Then there's something called Project Morpheus Prologue. Seems like just like the first like intro stage of a game that isn't out yet. Uh, plus recently, I, I like I want to say like last week, I played a little bit of Van Brace Cold Soul. I want to make more progress in that game. Been playing Phasmophobia a lot. Um, Scarlet Nexus. That was going to be my next video game playthrough. So I think I'll start Scarlet Nexus on Saturday. I played the demo on the PS4, but I figured it would just be easier to get the PC version. Yeah, tomorrow I'm probably going to be playing a bunch of games. Well, I trailed on long enough. Um, yeah, this, this was a fun game. I'm glad my friend recommended it to me. Yeah, not much else, not much else to say. Uh, 
Hope everyone had fun. Hope you have a good night or a good day, wherever, whenever you are in the world. And I'll see you later. Goodbye.